formation of Uganda. The Ministry of Water and Environment is a government ministry to ensure provision of quality water and environmental protection service charged with the management and sustainable utilization of water and environmental resources. Gloria Mbabazi reports. The Ministry of Water and Environment, together with Workers' Association Uganda, have organized a walk for water, environment and climate as a pre-event activity for the Uganda Water and Environmental Week 2022. The Minister of State for Water, Aisha Sechindi, has flagged off the walk, starting from Ministry of Water in Luzira to Lira, which will take 15 days. The presence of OHT Wamaria Munkalubo, Mayanja, the Minister of Environment and Bulunjuansi of Uganda Kingdom at this flag of event. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope that this, this work will provide an opportunity to see realities on the ground regarding degradation of water and the environment resources, but also existing, existing and the potential opportunities for utilizing these resources to create employment and wealth among our people. This goes to the workers. I request you that you don't focus on the distance to be covered, but rather on the way to work, on the way the work can be used to raise awareness about water and environment issues and also change attitudes of the people along the way towards um, more sustainable management of water and environmental resources and addressing impacts of climate change. Mariam Mayanjan Kalubo, the Minister for Environment of Buganda, has also remarked that as a country, we need to protect, to restore and preserve the environment. Environment are the key component of our survival. So we need to preserve, protect, restore, and conserve these natural resources. And as for us in Buganda, what I may, I may add on, that Buganda to exist, we need the environment. We cannot do without the environment. That's why the Katikiro, the Kabaka, they come up very strongly with the strong voices and messages because we have our clans. And all our clans are part of the environment. That's why we need to preserve, protect, and restore the environment. While talking to the chief worker, Geoffrey Ayeni, from the Uganda Workers Association, he says a lot has been achieved from the previous works, and for this particular work, a million trees will be planted along the way. Uh, we've been working so far, that is from 2017, uh, if you can count, it should be about uh, five years now. We have worked in different areas of this country. We've walked to Kachorwa twice, we've walked to Kasese twice, we've walked to Zoka Forest twice, we've walked to Mbarara River Ruiz, we've walked to River Nyamwamba, and this time we are walking 450 kilometers to Lira. Yes, uh, I believe we've, we have achieved a lot because uh, uh, we've, we've delivered message and out of this work we've promoted tree planting. Very many people in the areas where we've gone through have been able to plant trees. And right now, this work alone, we have about one million tree, actually one million tree seedlings that has been provided by NFA. So as a result of this work, we are going to see one million trees planted. The walk will cover a distance of approximately 450 kilometers through Kampala, Mabira Forest, River Nile, Iganga, Namutumba, River Mpologoma, Tirinyi, Budaka District, Mbale, Bukeda District, Kumi District, Soroti District, Kamera Maido District, Olenyu Wetland, Okolo District, Ogota Central Forest Reserve to Lira City.